Hey, all right, all right. So what's up, YouTube? It's your boy Cliff again. So I got a, uh, I got a, uh, two of them here uh, for us. I'm, I'm gonna try to remember both of them as uh, clear as I can. You know. Um, so can you relate? So I was younger, you know, and uh, I had a situation um, where I had a neighbor and. See, I'm I'm mulatto, you know, I'm mixed, black and white. And this distinctive neighbor, he was actually directly across the street, you know. And you know, I would uh go out my house, you know, do the normal stuff, go to school, you know, backpack all the other stuff, right? Well, every for a while there, almost every morning he would just give me this mean, like, you know, like this grumpy look and stuff, you know. And then I would start walking down the sidewalk, right? Well, the dude, he would um, pretty much <laughs> just uh, these mean mugs all the time. And I mean all the time, okay? And, you know, I, I guess I reacted wrong, you know. I looked at him and I gave him a mean mug back. Well, from that point, um, he said something crazy, you know, and I dismissed it, all right? And then, so next thing you know, days go by and all that, and so then he starts saying more and more crazy stuff to me. Now, need I mind you, I was like 16 years old, you know, I was boxing, I was, you know, I was demonstrating, you know, like going around boxing people with boxing gloves out the back of my car and all this other stuff right well um at that time i was just walking around going and meeting friends you know going different places boxing all this other stuff you know like we, we was wild boxing in the middle of the street all this other crazy stuff well besides that so you know we went behind the house well it wasn't a house he was like in these apartment things and we would all box in the little corner area over there well, I guess he was like watching, you know, he seen how, you know, I was training people and all that other stuff. Well, he's for some odd reason had some type of grudge against me. Well, the dude, one day I'm sitting there walking. I go to walk past his car, right? It was some Jeep, right? Some type of, some type of Jeep. Well, uh, I go to walk past his car and all that. And, um, he starts yelling at me, you know? Like, oh, don't, don't, don't bump into my Jeep. Ah, just all this crazy stuff. And I didn't bump into his Jeep, right? And so my neighbor, okay, he seen that this old man kept on harassing me. Well, I'm sorry. At the time, the guy wasn't old, you know. Like, he was in his 20s, you know. Maybe he was like 24, 25, something like that, you know. I was, you know, 16. So next thing you know... um, he starts yelling at me, uh, talking about uh, that I think I'm a man and all this other stuff, and I'll beat your young ass up, blah, 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 you know what I'm saying? And honestly, I wanted to put my hands on him, you know? I wanted to beat him up bad, okay? And I remember talking to my mother and all other people about it, my friends, everybody was talking about knock him out, this and that, da, 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 da. But, you know, I couldn't really bring myself to it, you know? Because uh, I, I knew what I was capable of, you know, because at the time, like, I'm talking about I was literally fighting like seven people at one time and everything, you know, and training other people also. I, I was pretty a pretty good fighter. OK, well, so I kept dismissing and kept on and kept on and kept on. Well, there came a day that he I guess he called himself trying to bully me right and the dude ends up coming outside and literally walked across the street i was at my neighbor's house and my neighbor was i i knocked on his door trying to get him to come out there trying to say hey this guy's coming over here i think he's about to mess with me you know like i'm trying not to hurt this man and so my neighbor you know i kind of kind of looked up to the dude you know big old i'm talking about big old swole buff black dude right 
and uh like he ain't play games and all that other stuff you know i actually learned a lot of fighting and stuff from him also box with his son everybody else you know what i'm saying box with him you know and so the dude comes over there and he's like he's pushing me trying to get me to fight him and all that right and from that point i told him i said look i don't want to fight you i don't want to fight you you know what i'm saying and i swear to god he starts dropping the end bomb all this other stuff right as soon as he said this as soon as he said that you know what i'm saying next thing you know he come out my homeboy he come out right as he came out he said, what did you just say? You know what I'm saying? He yelled. He's like, what you, you know what I'm saying? He's like, what you just say? And then he's like, y'all heard what I said, this motherfucker right here. And, da, 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 da. and as soon as he went to slide that out his mouth, all you hear is that, but, but I'm talking about with a bow. I'm talking about he slept him. Dude was on the ground snoring, eyes wide open. <laughs> I was like, oh, oh, oh my God. So, um, you know, I kind of felt like a little protection type thing from there. And, you know, but, you know, this same individual that ended up protecting me, that same individual ended up, you know, sleeping with my girlfriend and all this other stuff. But that, that's another story some other time, you know. Uh, but, you know, the basis of that one is that the dude ended up uh you know when he came back to and all that he was one 100 you know he let us know you know that he you know is really racist for real you know and so we end up getting to talking and this and that and i went into my spill of the fact that you know some individuals well actually all for real all humans like we don't get to choose we don't get to choose what this right here is you know we don't get to choose what our skin tone our rate our race and all that is you know what i'm saying so i get to talking to him next thing you know long story short he came around but look uh so if y'all can relate to that or anything or relate to a situation like that go ahead hit that like subscribe leave a comment in the box below i did not get to the other story but it's gonna be in this next video all right.